Yes, my name is Dr. Carl Hill. I'm actually a very famous neuroscientist and a researcher about brain death. And I'll give you a little bit of my theory here. Is, um, as you can see, I have a dissected brain fresh from the morgue here. Uh, and as I'm fond of pointing out to my students, um, my research into dying tells me there's no denying the brain lives longer after death than we had first surmised. Yes, wow, I'm good. Dr. Hill. I know your work quite well. Oh. Ah. Your theory on the 6 to 12 minute limit before the occurrence of brain death is... Is what? Interesting. Interesting! I am Graham Skipper. I'm an actor currently playing Herbert West in Reanimator the Musical. Uh, yeah, directed by Stuart Gordon. It's really fun. It's playing through August 14th in Los Angeles. So come on up and see it. Hi, my name is Jesse Merlin. I'm playing Dr. Carl Hill in Reanimated Musical. <laughs> It's a great film for us because both Graham and I are huge Lovecraft nerds and great admirers of Stuart Gordon's film, uh, Reanimator, and of course all of Stuart's Lovecraft films. So, very happy to be here. I fondly recall my research in Zurich when Dr. Hans Gruber and I would sit with our cups of steaming hot cocoa and read as the hours flew by. We obtained a new manuscript one day by a Dr. Hill of the USA. Gruber read it, then he froze, then he snorted Coco out his nose. He's a plagiarist, he's a, a villain and a, a scoundrel. Uh, no, it's, it's been great, you know, everybody's been coming up saying, oh my god, we love Reanimator, you know, either they've seen the show or they've, they've seen the film, which is, which is legendary. And it's just been a real treat, this is my first time at the con, I'm like, it's yeah, amazing. It's fantastic. It's been a thrill for us too. Most of the, the cast of the original movie came out to see it. Bobby Cranford just came for the second time. So it was a real thrill for us, as fans of the movie, to get to participate in part of its continuing legacy. Plagiat! Luper said him Plagiat! He screamed Plagiat! In the German tongue, for Plagiat's plagiarism, you see, and rather nice when it's sung. Germans say a Plagiat! Gruber said it plagiat just like deja vu. He'd been there before. Everything Hill wrote, Gruber wrote first, and that makes you a plagiator. How'd you guys get into Lovecraft? Yeah, you know, it's funny. I also got into Lovecraft through the metallic song they call it Cthulhu. Uh, I heard that and I was like, what the hell is Cthulhu? And then I looked it up and I immediately went to, I, I grew up in, in Texas, so I immediately went to the nearest bookstore and Somehow they had the only thing Lovecraft that they had was the Call of Cthulhu in this little, this little like paper single like pamphlet thing, and it was missing the last two pages. <laughs> it really pissed me off. And I read it, and then I was talking to somebody about this, and I was like, "It's this wild story. I've never read anything like it." And they said, "Well, you've got to see Reanimator." And so then I saw Reanimator, which just totally, you know, blew my pre-adolescent mind. Time as a teenager. I mean, when you get to the with decapitated seduction, at least for me, that's a real come to Jesus moment. I mean, you, you, it, it, you're never going to quite look at um, sex or horror quite the same way. But uh, I love Lovecraft on a very deep level. He's buried as deeply in my consciousness as about anything. This musical has been a real thrill. I mean, for those, we, we're both great admirers of Stewart and his film. So to approach something as perfect as a Jeff Combs or a David Gill performance is intimidating and also. Very and a huge honor. It's, it's, yes. been, it's been a wild ride. Ideas can occur in two places at one time. Great minds think alike. Yes, that's true. And when, in this case, you refer to great minds, you're speaking of Gruber and who? <laughs> Plagiat. Everyone in Europe knows in each capital and every little town. Gruber exclaimed as he tugged on his hair. Ah, this stuff was old. Then I wrote it down. That's enough. That is really quite enough. Thank you, Mr. West. I'll see you in class. Oh, good. Maybe if I learn how to steal from men who are smarter than myself, 
I'll pass. You're actually, you play... I played I play Herbert West in Reanimated the Musical, directed by Stuart Gordon himself. Oh my uh, God. The entire special effects team from the film, John Beeler, uh, Tony Dublin, and everyone uh, is involved. Uh, it's quite a fun time running through August 14th at the Steve Allen Theater. The Graham Skipper is fantastic. This is Jesse Merlin, okay. Dr. Carl Hill, Carl Hill, the head of medicine. Get it? We've had a lot of really great response from awesome like people like you. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a lot of fun. It's a great show. So um, get yeah. there early and get in the front row. Yes, we'll get to meet me and my zombie intestine hose full of blood. Uh, yeah, you know. So uh, I. My intestines. <laughs> you have balls, my boy, but I'm not impressed. Only time will tell if there's anything worth stealing from your overrated mind, Mr. West. <laughs>